New ASICs are arriving. Ledger than an oopsie. Exchanges are being updated. And I got a response from Squirrel for the Acorn Miner. And this is your host, Rom Burgundy. And you're watching Hot Info on Crypto. All right, so for the first news, it looks like two new ASICs are coming out. If you did check out ASICminerValue.com, it looks like Bitmain and Inel Silicon are coming out with Equihash ASICs. The Bitmain one is called the Antminer Z11, and the Inel Silicon is called the A9++ Z Master. Now, if you did check out the Bitmain website, it looks like the Antminer Z11 is already sold out. But checking out Inno Silicon's website, it looks like you can order the Equihash A9++ Z Master. But I do hear that Inno Silicon is very bad on delivering on time. All right, so I did break down each ASIC from Bitmain and Inno Silicon. Now it looks like the Z11 and the A9++ Z Master are pretty similar, but it looks like it's actually just three times the Inno Silicon A9 Z Master. But I'll go ahead and pause this for about 10 seconds so you can check this out. Alright, so for the next news, it looks like Ledger did an oopsie. Now I did pre-order the Ledger Nano X, but it is being delayed. Now to summarize this email, it states that it is going to be delayed for at least a month. And the reason why is they did order materials, but it was rejected. And because it is being delayed, Ledger is going to send a free Nano S along with the Nano X. Now I do appreciate the free Nano S, but I do already own two. And the reason I bought the X is because it can hold a lot more wallets compared to the Nano S. So I may just give away the free Nano S. All right, so for the next news, I'm going to talk about two exchanges that are having updates. Now, the first exchange is Bitrix. It looks like they are asking everyone to be fully ID'd with their picture and a government ID. Now, I'm actually not down with that. So I did already move all my coins out and I'm not going to come back to this exchange. Now for the next exchange, Cryptopia. Now, luckily, I did not have a lot of coins on this exchange. But back in January 14th, they did experience a hack. Now they are back up and running and it looks like they are trying to reimburse everyone. But to be honest, because of that hack, more than likely Cryptopia is not going to recover. All right, so going on to the next news, I did get a response from Squirrel. Now I did receive the upgrade Acorn 215 Plus. And checking out my device manager, you will see that the Acorn CLE 215 Plus is there. This is a quick clip of the Acorn 215 Plus in my computer. All right, so thanks for checking out this episode of Hot Info on Crypto. I'm Ron Burgundy, and don't just have a great night, have a crypto night. <laughs>